don't know too much about Kasumi and uh, and uh, what you call it. Okay, so your your basic stun is like that, uh, which is a uh, 3P. It's safe. You have that, you know, you can go over, you can go over wake up picks with that. But like I said, it's really different compared to the older, um, newer models. So usually, usually when you get stunned. Oh, okay, so. The critical stun? That's what you want to bring him far away, it'll be punch, 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 kick. That's what you want to take him far away. No, for whatever reason. So, so what are we critical stun with? Um, Forward punch? Any any launcher. Any launcher? Any launcher, right? But it won't launch? No, no, that will launch. It's just that I'm like slow right now. Oh my gosh. I hate when that, that goes on there. I need like three cancel it. Now I see why they took that out in the UA3+. Plus. So you press punch, punch, and then a critical stun. Yeah, three point three PP stuns. In the water, it automatically stuns in the first step. Oh yeah, because the water uh, thing. Yeah. So three PP. But yeah, that's because of the water. But like four punch doesn't like stun normally. But okay, okay. But three PP does, and it's safe. So three PP. That's usually a basic one if you want to keep them closest. It's uh, punch, punch, score, punch, kick. Uh, so yeah. I do that when, once I get them in there? Yeah. So what, what, what do I launch? You said any launcher? Yeah, yeah. But which so, one are you using? You got up kick. That's one of them. That's your high kick launcher. Um, so after critical stun, it'll launch it. Yeah, it's, it's DOA 3, so any, any stun will launch. Why is it? Why? Oh, that's a distance thing? Really? Uh, like a proximity? It, yeah, in D Wave 3 Plus, they took that out. They took out the proximity thing in, in Plus. Okay, so that's why. Alright, alright, so now that. Yeah, this is cool because you've been playing D Wave Plus Plus. Do you have that at home? Yeah, on PC. On emulator? Yeah, yeah, you can do it. You can, it um, there's a thing on Free Step Dodge. You can download it. Yeah? Yeah. Somewhere in there. They have several tutorials. My one brain cell is able to do it. So, now that I found out that's freaking proximity. So I'll check out Free Step Dodge and I can download Plus Plus? Yeah. Because I've been trying. I don't like all that freaking. To do that. It's freaking close. I don't know why. Okay, so yeah, I'm just gonna do. Uh, yeah, so we have the mythic launchers, is that. Like I said, like on your juggles, really, it just depends on what you want. Like if you want to bring them far away, you're just gonna do punch, punch. Wow, I didn't even. So like punch, punch. Like punch, punch, forward, punch, kick if you want them close. So, it's like 71. Yeah, yeah, forward, punch, yeah, right away. And that's the same damage, but it puts them far away. So that's if you, what you depend on what you want. Sometimes you don't want them close to you because you don't want to deal with the wake-up game. So you think these combos work in DOA 4 also? No, 4 is different. In 4, in 4 you're doing that. Yeah, I've because seen that. The reason why you're doing that in 4 is because, because she has a teleport. Yeah. Out of that. So you do punch, punch, backflip, and then you will teleport down and hit them and it does more damage than that. That's why I was saying like, 
we, we, but that's the only thing that changes, honestly, it's just that DOA 5, her combo links completely, they're completely different. They're completely different. There's, there's, there's five combos, bread and butters, and all depends on if there's a wall behind you and etc. But here, in DOA 3, it's pretty basic. It's just, if you do that, if you want them far away, and you do that, if you want them close. You know what I mean? She have advanced holds? We don't need all that in this game. I think she has advanced hold, I think. You know any other characters? No, just that. I don't I don't usually Yeah, because this game's all yeah, yeah, that's all you need. No, it's not that it's that. It's just that I um No, she has no advanced hold. They they swapped that uh they gave her advanced hold in five. Advanced hold in five. Um uh, Lei Feng, Slobber characters, they have advanced hold. Yeah, yeah, she's not advanced hold. She has the parries, though, her parries. She has those. <laughs> Which are, you know, the same thing as, uh... What'd you just send it to, man? No, the Oh, oh yeah, you yeah. showed me the parry? Yeah, she has a parry. So, does she always have this? Yeah, she always had this, since, like, so, two. So, explain to me how this works. She has this in the new games? No, she had it since two. So she always had it. Like even in the new games. Yeah, no, yeah, she always had the parry. So how does this work? I don't know how this works. It's the same way as every other parry works. You just hit a uh, uh, forward up, so, or, aka uh, eight. So you know how I used to play um, Marie Rose? Marie Rose has something like this, right? How it's like. Yeah, um, she has a parry. What is it? Yeah, what's it called exactly? It's called parry, or like it's called. Uh, she has a parry. She has a stance. It's like when she spins, right? That's a different thing. Yeah, what's that called? You know what um, I'm talking about? That's, a, that's just basically a stance. It's a, it's, it's a sabaki. It's a sabaki, basically. So hold on, how, to teleport, what do I press? It's a back forward up, or back forward down, aka uh, four, four nine, four nine or four three. Back forward up? Yeah. Oh, that's great. Yeah, see, it's right there. And hold? Whoa. Yeah, hold. That works? Yeah. So yeah, it's kind of like a, what's it called, an offensive yeah. hold or whatever? No, no, it's just a parry. So par hold. parries, yeah. parries are not an advanced hold. They're, they're pretty simple. Um, you don't usually do high parry, you usually do mid parry. So like, because parry, parries cover two options at the same time. So you never you never parry high, there's no reason to parry high. Because it's like, you can just counter high. So, you know, why, why take the gamble of the parry where it can go wrong? And they're just taking the damage. So, so people usually parry mid because, because you know, in uh, other games. Oh yeah, that's right. This this game in DOA three, that's right. It covers everything. Never mind. Parry parry covers everything in this game. They took that out. What is, once. So, so what do you mean it? it what is what does parry cover? It covers high. It and doesn't mid. cover high. It covers highs and mids. Covers highs and mid. Only in this game. That's what I'm saying. Like, like and in the and new ones. It, no, no, they do. They took that out. It only no. covers mid. It only covers mid or high, unless unless you have a specific character that can carry low. Like that, that's like that's like the stuff you have to like, you know, uh, kind of go in the lab and figure out on your own. On but, you, that. but you said even though it covers both, don't parry highs, just, just uh... Might as well just counter at that point. You hold the high? <laughs> yeah, unless you have a character that gets the guaranteed damage. There's no reason to parry high. Why not? Because think about it, like if you parry high, let's, 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 let's just say you're in match point, game point, and you know it's gonna do a high. And, you're, and they're like 20, 30%. And you're like, oh, I'm gonna parry high. I'm gonna do this combo. You parry high, you probably get a guaranteed two hits. They counter you. Now you're on the floor. You're both at the same health. You're doing a wake up game. He counters your wake up game. And you just lost the match because you decided to parry high. When you could have just high countered. Yeah, because it doesn't like d do damage. Like she just teleported out of there. Yeah, it's not guaranteed. You only guarantee a certain amount of hit. It's the same thing with, uh, with Nico. If I get a high counter throw, I'm not gonna do the combo. Why would I do the combo? You can you can guess out of the combo. Yeah. I'm just gonna go for the guaranteed damage because it's, it's, it's just too much damage. Oh no, yeah, you're teaching me. I'm I'm gonna learn. Yeah. But that that's why in in five, I think it's the same thing in four. 
DOA 4 and up, there's no reason to really parry high because, because you know, why parry high if you don't get guaranteed damage from it? You just, you know, you're just not gonna, you can lose a match from that. I've seen that happen, you know, people will parry high and they'll go for the, the this big combo and it's like, you just, they just die and it's like, they guess right out of the combo. Especially in DOA 6 when you have break hole, you know what I mean? They can just break hole out of it, aka burst out of it. So that's why people, when they have a parry, character that has parry, they never usually parry high, it's rare. They always parry mid because in, because the mid, you, you, you're you not guessing mid kick or mid punch, you're just guessing mid. It takes away the four way hold, it's a three way hold for you now. You just parry mid, you know, they do a mid kick, you get it. If you do a mid punch, you get it. Because um, if you don't have a parry, you have to guess mid kick, mid punch. And also got to guess high or low. So that's why you parry mid you don't want to guess mid kick or mid or punch if they're gonna launch you know what i mean so, so i need to do that more in my game like yeah it depends on the character you know what i mean so like uh mary 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 rose's parry system works like in any attack that hits them that's mid or high you know what i mean when she spins you know but like i said in three like I said, three is a, like a different game than like five. That's that's why a lot of people. That's why there's a lot of diversity in, in what people like in the game. Like, like, because the games change a lot. Games change a lot. But yeah, the, so but for combos in three and in four, it's pretty much pretty much same thing as three. It's only, it's only until five where it's like everything for all, everything you know about the me out the window. Just, just throw it out the window because it's. Cause it's not, it's not, it's like so far from optimal. It's not even funny. So I, that's why I don't play Kasumi in other games. Play Phase Four just because like I don't want to keep adjusting. You know, I have Phase Four and Five. Phase Four, if I play Phase Four, I'm not playing Kasumi, so my mind's not trying to do DOA three stuff. It's just gonna do DOA five. If I go, but if I play any other game, oh there. Everything's gonna work because Kasumi doesn't change that much. Like the only difference is in like four is that is that you know when I do the you know when I launch them when I like launch them in the air I uh, basically freaking you know I just do uh, like that this combo that and, and five I mean in four yeah. but in but in five you're doing like you're doing Hit punch, punch, something, teleport, sit down, stun, teleport, and some other stuff, you know what I mean? Like, like it's just completely different. Yeah. I don't like how that, that's like freaking thing. But yeah, that's that's the basics really, just. Damn, I feel like you taught me. But no, that, that's really just the basic, like, Kasumi's really a basic character, because she's the poster character, she's, uh, she's, she's supposed and to be I, easy, And I but... have, like, DOA fundamentals, but, <laughs> like, yeah, like, the way you walk me through, like, and this isn't even, like, the new games, but, like, at least the old games, like. Yeah, so, like, I really do, like, I study this game, I have, like, some fundamentals, like, I just need to, like, practice more. I used to have good routes with high but I just play, like, fundamentals. Yeah, fundamentals is just with carries, with carries, you know what I mean? Like, she probably said that I had no idea what the hell I was doing. I was just playing basic 2D stuff until I started remembering my combos. Yeah. But then Jamie, Jamie also, like, not always, like, not always, like, a traditional Street Fighter character. Like, I'm playing, like, Guile, throwing uh, fireballs and anti-air. Jamie, Jamie plays a new game. This map is so good. I don't know why it does that. So in DOA why, 6... I don't wonder why they made a plus. Like, in crazy. DOA 6, the map with the water, so like... Shit will like critical stun. Yeah, they have stun stun in there too. What were they like? Actually, like fall too? <laughs> no, or, like it's or a just, stun. It is, yeah. it, the stuns are just deeper in, in the water. Any anytime you're on water, ice or snow, things that wow. you will slip, you 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 yeah. stun. Literally DOA shit. Is there even ice or snow in DOA six? Yeah, there's a there's a map with snow. Uh, 
supposed to be snow, but it doesn't look like snow. It's that, it's that highway. No way. I think you're right, actually. No, that's supposed to be snow, but they rushed the game. <laughs> Did you hear about like they're releasing another costume in DOA and it's the final one? No, they they they're not doing anything. They're they they to... they've been done with that, right? Yeah. I, I thought they were, and then I thought I saw a tweet the other day. Nah, nah, it's probably fake because they yeah. they they they're not gonna spend money to to put something out. Cause it costs money to put something out, and it takes time. <laughs> <laughs> 